Kenny Loggins, top 10 in the USA. Now the top 10 for the countdown national charts. After services above and beyond the call of duty, Pat Benatar has been honorably discharged from the top 10. Matthew Wilder is also breaking out as he strides from 7 to 9. The Thompson Twins have their first Australian hit as Holby Now goes from 16 to 8 from their Into the Gap LP, which went straight to number one in Britain. As the Swing LP goes straight to number one on the Countdown album chart, in excess, send a message to number seven. You're my She's my only one. Queen's Brian May has a solo LP out called Star Fleet One, which Freddie Mercury's been working on with Michael Jackson. This week, Radio Gaga drops three places. Frankie's new Mad Max-inspired single, Two Tribes, is out next month. Meanwhile, they're relaxing at number five. For the second week at number four, Marilyn, who'll be our special guest on Countdown next week. Van Halen lead singer David Lee Roth is famous for his spectacular stage leap. He once even parachuted into the audience. This week it's a jump back to number three. I wonder who's flown up to number one, as Cindy Lauper is now having fun at number two. Hey, and now it's back to Tom, Jenny, Alan, and Steve.